So these are the before photos. So we start with doing liposuction, Dr. Hoyos technique. We use some technology to help us. And this is the way we do liposuction. First we do the midline and then we do the lateral lines, the lateral borders of the rectus muscle. We do deep and superficial liposuction in these areas. And after that we do the liposuction in the rest of the areas, in the lateral abdomen, in the central abdomen and in the pubic area. After that we start abdominoplasty, we raise the flap, we do the selective undermining, a tunnel undermining in the upper abdomen like Dr. Saudanias to preserve the perforators from the epigastric arteries, then we do the plication and then we do the removal of the excess of the flap. We cut above the umbilicus because we're going to create a new one and this is how we create the new umbilicus. This is the final result on table. Now we are doing the umbilicus. We do a technique, uh, an X technique uh, as Alfredo Hoyos. We cut the skin. Then we do the defatting. And now we have four flaps, the upper and lower and, la and left and right flaps. And we're going to join the left flap, the lower flap and the right flap all in one suture. We're going to put this into the muscle fascia. So this is the first suture. And now we're going to do the second suture that is joining the upper flap with the abdominal fascia. And that is how we finish the umbilicus. It's very easy, it's very simple and the result is great. We don't have hypertrophic scars, this is the result. only 15 days after surgery. So you see a natural result with a natural umbilicus.